Today's the day I finally fly out to America. I'm going to be vlogging the whole way, starting from right now, so I'm in my work uniform, and all the way till we arrive in Detroit. So, keep yourselves tuned in, watch in HD, because you are watching Florence Ballad A3060, the channel made in loving memory of the original Supreme Florence Ballad, and Hoover's first 1100 RPM washing machine, the A3060 Electronic 1100. <laughs> In the early morning rain With a dollar in my hand That's good, it's not, it's not um, very normal, well, you never really see me, do you, in my work uniform. <laughs> this is because um, today's the actual day I'm flying out, but I'm going to work first. Um, I'm just going to smudge that, aren't we? A bit of a lens flare. So, um, time is now 9.32am, I'm going to be literally heading out now straight after I put this camera down and then I'll be um, I'll be vlogging from basically when I come back you know I've got everything packed there I must take that toothbrush out of the thing got my bag there yeah so we got we got we're all good to go really um, yeah so our flight is until 22.35 tonight so we'll be leaving here around I say 7.30 or something I'll say 7.30 I'll say, and then we get there for 8 or so, 7.15, we'll do, we'll do that. The earlier we get there, the better. Um, you're supposed to be there two hours before your check-in time, so maybe 7.30 would be a good idea then. Then I can sit around for like half an hour or something. Um, we can fly from Terminal 4. I will be going by Piccadilly Line. I was going to go by TFL Rail, but I thought, nah, let's go by the underground. We, we know the underground. Um, you know, it's a bit, I like going a familiar route. Um, yeah, so that's what we'll be doing, guys, and... Um, I may actually do something I've never done before today actually, I may take my camera into work and just quickly vlog a little bit of myself during the day so I could be like towards the end of the day, oh, guys it's the end of the day now, you know, I <clears throat> might do that, I've never really done that before, um, I have to talk very quietly though, but I might, be able to, I might be able to get away with doing it a bit, we'll see. Um, so yeah, guys, I'm going to put that down. I hope you like, by the way, I hope like, you like the new way I've done my intro now, I thought it was something that didn't seem right on this channel that I have my intro first and then I do my pre-spoken intro. So I do a spoken pre-intro when I say like, you know, so keep yourselves tuned in and whatnot. And then I actually pause the video and I start again. Now what we should do is, what I'm thinking of doing is what you, I've just done here. Um, trialing it out, see how it goes. Um, saying the first part, like, you know, so today, for example, I'm flying out to America doing a vlog. So keep yourselves tuned in and that part. Then we cue my actual intro, which is, the way it was last year with America, we have different intros um, for each video, um, and there'll be like a, a soundtrack. The song will be sort of corresponding with what I'm doing. So, I hope you guys like what I've chose for for this one. <laughs> um, and then we've got basically then the actual video starts. Channel that inspired me to do that. I don't know if you guys know of a channel called called um, I'll put it down at the bottom. Good Mythical Morning. Uh, Rhett and Link, they're from, I don't know where they're from actually, somewhere, I think they might be North Carolina or somewhere in America, but they're like a, they look into a lot of stuff in the world and like, you know, discover why this, you know, what, why do we do this all, they experiment with stuff and it's, it's quite cool what they do, so that, I like the idea that they would speak like, we're, <clears throat> so an example, um, say for example, they're looking at, uh, abandoned prisons or something like today we're going to be looking at abandoned prisons let's talk about that and then they cue their actual intro and then they say good mythical morning so like that's what I thought of doing and it actually to be honest to me it seems a lot better it's what I always knew that there was something that wasn't right about the way I was doing my intro well, that's what it is so anyway guys I'm not going to hold on for too long because I've got to, got to scoot um, but yeah I will catch up with you later tonight when I'm um, when I'm getting ready to go I'll definitely shave all this moustache off before I go. <laughs> so guys, catch you then. Okay guys, it's 19.30 right now, and I'm just getting ready to go to Heathrow. So, got everything here, bag done, my suitcase. That's how you'll identify it's mine. See the Supreme thing, sticker, and that is Diana Ross, Mary also Florence Ballard. Hope you all like the music I used for my intro, by the way, as well. I was originally going to use Club Tropicana by Wham, but I thought I'd use that instead. And Care Bear coming along with me today, uh, this will fly, is Love A Lot Bear. <laughs> I've also got Sussy Sweep and Sue in there. I'm going to get a photo of them with Mary Wilson. Mm -hmm. 
put that in there. So, yep, we are off. Florence on there. Okay, so just a quick, quick, yep, we're going. I am excited. Put my Oyster card in my pocket so I do not forget that. In case you might notice I've got new shoes. <laughs> yeah, there's my old ones I still wear. You might hear them creaking because I only brought them yesterday. They're white uh, Dr. Martin's 1460s. So, yeah, I'm going to wear that uh, in a retro outfit uh, for the all white party. I'm going to dress up like Wham, George Michael. I mean, I know they didn't wear Dr. Martin's, but I thought they're white and that's what I want to get. Annoying little fly, you're not coming with me. Guys, yeah, the Cassata was on earlier and it did the most unbalanced one I've ever seen. She walked out of the place when she was at 1000. Um, probably angry that I'm going. <laughs> so, yeah, bags all packed, and uh, I guess with that, we'll be off. So, I'll catch you guys when, not at the bus stop, um, but I will catch you guys when I get to South Indian Station and we board the train. We're getting a Terminals 1, 2, 3 and 5 train first, getting off at Hatton Cross and changing for a Terminal 4 train. Um, no. No, 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 get off at Hounslow West and do it, sorry, get off at Hounslow West and then, yeah. Or saying, no, I get off at Hounslow Central actually, I get off at Hounslow Central and I get off there and change. Okay, guys, so, catch you there. So, update, I'm at South Ealing Station right now, I'm waiting for the train. The first train is the T4 train, but I'm waiting when something... Oh, get lost, the voice. A quick snack along the way, here. bloody Coca-Cola. Here comes our first one, but I'm not getting that one. T4 train, but I want the terminals, one, two, three, and five, for the announcements. Can't wait to receive my tags. 777 going over us somewhere. I don't know what airline I'll be. Got got some off here. Yeah, that was, there we go. Coming out. Carriage number 173. Guys, terminal one, two, three, and five. Then we get off at Hounslow Central. That change for the terminals four and one, two, three. We're not actually that busy because for some reason everyone gets off at South Reading. This is a Piccadilly line service to Heathrow terminals one, two, three, and five. Guys, this is it, we're going. So we are still in. Two stop, isn't it? 960 stop, I guess. 
the asset inspection train. I don't know what that does, but it's uh, consisting of 1972 stock and 1967 stock, the Victoria line. Coming round the bend, it's a Piccadilly line. I'm rubbish thingy. Look at that. I'll be so sad the day that the 1973 stock is replaced. There we are. Pop me in front of my pocket quickly. To hear the difference. Look at that voice. Oh, oh, they said who the guy's name was. That voice has been here since I've Mind been like two years old. Bloody empty. Mind the gap. Mind the gap. Please mind the gap between the train mind and the platform. The this is Hounslow East. This is a Piccadilly line service to Heathrow Terminal 4 and 123. Maybe not. This is it. Let me 
Louis Vuitton en même temps. The problem with the announcements there. Hounslow like West. I never hardly ever used that station. See my dad there though. He used to work while the hands were barracks. <coughs> there you go, it's better for me. As I said, no one's gonna sit there. Ooh that. Jennifer Lawrence. side would be going to terminal 4 and that side is terminals 1, 2, 3, 5 or Heathrow Central and terminal 5 and the proposed Heathrow East I think it's Ladies and gentlemen, Heathrow Central 5, please take next slide. It's got an email. So I'm using 4G. I don't know what my data charge is though for America. I think I can still use it, data roaming. Back on the ground. That's a care bear rat in this. But I just didn't want anyone. I didn't want anyone around my local area to see. Because, you know, I mean, obviously now I'm probably at Terminal Four. I can take her out. But yeah, when I was, I mean, one thing I have to say, guys, is I may not be able to record a lot in the terminal because you know how tight airport security is. But I will try my utmost best to get what I can. I'll report when we're arriving at Terminal 4. I think this is it. I saw her out on the platform. She'll have to be strapped to my bag. I'm alone. Oh god, I hardly. We, the last time we used T4 was when we did my Australia vlog. Yeah. Sort her out over here. Because I can't walk with a terminal like that. Oh god, fluorescent bulbs. So we went there, uh, Aero Mexico. Oh. I 
uh, what we care about filming there, guys, because it's true. The film has been quite rubbish at times, it's just because I've got to be so careful. Um, maybe it's not open yet, actually. Let me have a look. General information. Uh, zone E. Zone E. I won't be able to film the check-in process, guys, though. It's a very tight security there. There's a T4. Probably I want to get some. Alright, guys, so we have just cleared security. We're here. I wanted to just quickly get all that done. I had this bit of a panic moment when I was at the... Um, I saw where we sat here. We'll have a look around and see what we can find. I had this moment of panic. I had a moment of panic where I thought, do I need a different visa to get into Mexico? And I was like bloody panicking at the, like in my head I was thinking, you know, swearing in my head. But it turns out, um, that's the quickest uh, booking, uh, check-in I've ever done, probably because I actually checked in online. But yeah, it's amazing. Look at that. This is SR T4. But <clears throat> I might eat at one of these expensive, I've got about, I've got about another hour, so until we have to be at the gate. So, we'll have a look at World Duty Free. I just wish I had a smaller camera. Dr. Martin just did the test so far. I feel bloody, I don't know. Yeah, it's really nice here though. I, th I think Terminal 2 would have to be my favorite out of every Terminal at Heathrow. Especially because of the way it's designed and the restaurants are nice. Yeah, Hugo Boss. Malaysia Airlines, departure to Kuala Lumpur, flight number 001, final call. Oh that was the flight we took to see to Australia. I remember that. I'm trying to find a hat, like a uh, straw hat. China Eastern Airlines, China Eastern. departure to Shanghai, Bedok, China Eastern was a oh, sky team, aren't they? Double H Smith. Now at gate nine. Let me have a look if I can see my, our, our gate first though, because if I can see our gate... Oh, they announced it in the... Let me have a look. Aero Mexico. All oh, right, 2235, they're already calling the gate. Go to gate 22. Oh, huh. Okay, gate 22. All right, that's fine. So nowhere to go. So let's go and get some... Oh, Hey guys, we're going to walk to the uh, to the gate now. Let's have a Costa and some sweets or candy, as I'd say. We're gate twenty-two. God, twelve and a half hour flight ahead of us. Jesus, fifteen minute walk. <laughs> You're probably kidding me. Beacon flashes. There's one for you, Lewis. Fire alarm there. Mm. Watermelon and the coconut. So good. Oh, dear. oh God, I've got one of these to go on. Everyone's looking at another lot there. Start on. Equipment liable to start on. What's the O2 fire extinguisher? Look at that. Amarna Air. Real bad storm hitting us. There's Aeroflot there, Airbus A330. Got a real bad storm hitting us tonight. I reckon we're going to be flying out in some lightning. It'd be spectacular to see that. We'll be on the Compton departure and we're on 09s. I've always wanted to fly out to America on 09s because when the aircraft depart, they're going down south. They do like an immediate sharp right turn to head over the Compton VOR. That's where Mum wants to go, New York. Look at that out there, guys. Oh, yes! We got the special livery! Oh, my dear Lord! We've got it! Oh, my God, yes! Oh, my 
Oh my dear lord. Unless it's a new livery, but that. Look at that. 2787's next to and an Airbus. What a beautiful looking Oh, anyone on golf here doesn't have the A330 tonight. They got the A320. 21. Yes. We got it. Oh my god, I was looking at a picture of one. I was thinking, I doubt we'll ever get that, and we do. Yeah, that is some serious storm. I can't see any lightning though. Yeah, this is brilliant. This is brilliant. The guy's looking at me, I'm freaking out. What's the registration? Let me get the registration. And I said that is important. X ray Alpha, Alpha Delta India. Zadi. That's how I'd probably pronounce it. And I could have. China Southern 304 though. So we're on a Boeing 787-9 Dreamliner. And our engines are, I think they're Rolls-Royce Trent 1000s. They're not, I don't think they're GENX. Oi, Korean Air. 747-8 that was, I think. Home. Look at that. Oh, sorry. Look at that. That's beautiful. We're going. We're boarding our flight now. Oh, we made it. Oh, I'm so excited. Got some Skittles and dairy milk in there. I saw the same lady check me in. Shut the corner. Oh, that's beautiful. We're on Aeromexico's first ever Boeing 787-9. That's why it's in that special livery. It's their first ever Dash 9 Dreamliner. I get the special livery. Just need to get smiling China now. Guys, we're on our flight. Taxiing now. Another Dreamliner over there, actually. That's close. They're coming. We're going to do the Compton due, uh, departure. <coughs> the engine sounds amazing. Despite the fact it's supposed to have quiet air engines. What's that, version 789 down? Yeah. Same what we're flying on. I think it's like it's taking their seats. We're turning. See, being Heathrow, I know. You see the beacon flashing down. But being Heathrow, I know where everything is there. 2 7 left, category 2 and 3. Once the cabin lights go off, because they dim for takeoff, like windsock. We've got that Air France and Vueling. Oh, what's the Egypt? I oh, know Egypt Air would have taken off by now, I think. MSR 780. You hear that? I think they're, I think they're Rolls Royce Trent 1000s. The 787 9 has. Might be wrong. I always call it a 777, as you know that. 
BA, that's, term, that's Terminal 5, that is. That's there where we flew up from Dallas Fort Worth. See, remember when I did my video? This is of place my Heathrow. Right? Sierra Quebec 4. Two seven seven. What's that? Category 1, 2. Florence. Florence Ballard. Mm. She likes a message, I think. Mm. It's a love heart. There we go. I think the guy next to me wants to move, so I hope everybody will run away. Version 8 and 789. I think our fuel tanks are going to be loaded quite a lot, so. Isn't it better that I've actually got. I, I love night flights. <coughs> Corey Mortimer, I really hope you enjoy this. You know what? I think the 787 is going to have a loud engine from it. Oh, 
look. What can I zoom in on? Oh, we're going into the cloud. Wow. Aeromexico. Uh, Aeromexico 8, contact London Control on 134 decimal 195, thank you. That's exactly what he'd be saying. Bloody hell.
have to put the camera away there because there was some cabin crew coming along. I mean, they saw me filming earlier, but bloody hell, that is. Where's the moon? Oh my god, I feel like I'm going through a loop on a roller coaster. It's beautiful, I should say. We're doing 200, 228 miles an hour. Proximo sala aterrizar. Safely at Mexico now. Uh, I've forgotten the name of the airport, but I know it's Mexico City, Starbucks. Uh. So I'm check. Um, I'm going to check where we go. Ooh, lovely. The flight was actually not too bad. Place is uh, still opening. Got um, oh, we've got like six hour wait here, so oh, no. oh. let's have a look. Come on, that ball up there. I don't know what security is like in Mexico, so it's quite nervous being in an airport where they don't, where not a lot of people speak English. I don't mind that, but it's just you know what I mean. It, obviously, English. Let's have a look. I should pop up on that ball up there. 
Can't read it. I just want to see. I uh, want my Aero Mexico 430, 430. Okay, guys, I've got breakfast. Margarita pizza and great punch. It is um, 6 15 a.m. here at Mexico. Oh, God, I've run around this airport and I want to get out. I do, seriously. It's just a Wi Fi page, so I'm chatting with the Princess. Princess and uh, Harry. Sat on the floor because I've got a charge. Oh, I've got to charge my camera as well. I better do that as well, actually. Oh, what have I got? An, oh, what am I scratching now? I get bite. I've been getting bites since the garden centre. My flight is overbooked by one seat. Oh, I don't know what's mine. Princess has come on the chat. I would like to be able to film myself eating. I need my white Dr. Martens. Alright, well, this is going to be difficult to hold and eat at the same time. Oh, they cut it into slices of, slice of four, and it's hot. This is be the longest vlog I've ever done, I think. Right. Those on bikes, by the way, they're spots that I seem to accumulate in the sun. Oh, oh I should have bought some bloody serviettes. It's going to get greasy. That cheese. Service gem upload in the video. What's it? Maloney. Only four and a half hours, but you know, well, it might be even shorter. I'm trying to burn my mouth. They're not there. There must be. <laughs> I must be looking because I've got a care bear here. I found myself eating. Alright, let's have a quick sip of grape juice. It's been so hot in this airport, I'm telling you. It's like probably like 23 degrees outside already. I can't see the sky brightening up yet though. Max at 11%, and he's, that's got one bar battery, you can't really charge that now. It's not fizzy. <sighs> so nice. I've got to be careful. I don't drink too much though because I need to. Right. I will catch you when we are going to our gate. This is it, guys? We are now boarding our flight to Detroit. Aero Mexico 430. I believe it's a Boeing 737 700 winglets. My first ever 737. I'm completing so many Boeing aircrafts. Just haven't done. There's our beauty there. Pam. Echo India. Pop out of the white. Oh, it's the old livery. Yes. Alpha, extra alpha. Pop out of the white. Dash 
車みたいですね。まあね、この路線は、まあ僕の車がこんな737になるんですね。
definitely over America. Look at that, guys. Juicy. I've got a whole road to myself. A whole bonnet.
21 out, 21 hours from here to Mexico to Detroit. And my phone is going to die. Oh my god, we're together. Oh my god. Hey, is that. Yeah. <laughs> here is our hotel, guys. America's best value. In. Stop getting drunk. Oh, here's our elevator. I don't know if you'll, you'll view my video, but Beno, no, Beno lifts. If you, if you view this, is for you because he likes. I ain't gonna lie, man. <laughs> I didn't even touch anything that did that. Oh my god, look! What the heck? You didn't touch it at all. That is so weird. Where are we, 412? Fourth floor. Whoa. It's the ghetto lift. Yeah, I know. Oh my god, it's like that place I stayed in Houston. Where is it? Did you say 12 or what? Yes. And that's gonna be this one. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm officially scared. I am too. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Oh, and if there's any of you guys that like exit signs, you can identify what that one is. I feel like I'm still on the elevator. I thought the floor's going to go in at any second. I want to kick this suitcase so hard. Oh, we've got an old phone. I've got a microwave. I'm scared to turn on this. Oh my God. Oh no. No, this one. Oh, oh it's one way to extract the pan. Hang on. Oh. I can't switch off that app. Look, an old phone. Oh, I want to get this thing the hell off me. This bag has been harassing me since Mexico. <laughs> what kind of beauty is in here? Um, Pizza Hut. <laughs> is that a radiator right next to the bed? No, the there. AC? In that cage. Oh, this? That's like like a, this is like an old school heater. I what the? I didn't even touch that. Sounds cool. Look at that. Guys, right, we're in Detroit. I feel like I'm in Dallas. Oh. <laughs> I spy a whirly bird. Got it. Let me get this looks like the semi girl in Dallas. Is it moving? Yes. There you are. Let's get a photo. There's another one there. And another. And another. Oh, that one's spinning. There we go. Oh, 
Come on, I'll take this one off. Just sleep next to the... Oh, that's scary, that is a heater. Which bed do you want? Hang on. Oh my god, this is so fancy, this bed. <laughs> Alright, guys, this is... Hey yeah, guys, look. It sounds like my... It sounds like my hot point when it's got an unbalanced load. The spring's going ching 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 ching. It's like... F She's in there. This is cold. Microwave. Oster, whoever the hell they are. Look at all this. What's this? Where's our light? I'm very worried what I've just done. What is this? I'm scared. I'm not, I'm not officially scared. What the? Although, to be honest, that does have the outlets there. But I have an extension. How good is that electrical system there? Is it surge guard? I don't know. We've got to check out the laundry here. What's this thing do? I'm going to touch that. I love you for that. This is an LG. Oh, turn that off. Uh oh. That didn't sound good. I'm scared of this. Is it just me or does this soap smell weird? What does it smell like? What the hell? <laughs> what? No, it smells different on both sides. It does? <laughs> what? That smells like lemon, like sherbet lemon on that side. And then this side is like... I don't know what the other side is. It's like stagnant, I don't know what it smells like. When you've left, you don't load a washing and you let it go stagnant and you can still smell the detergent oh through it. Oh, by the way, it's a spot. Okay, I've got a key. What the hell is this? Oh, huh. I don't know. Uh, what level was that on again? Oh, this is scary. What view do we get out of that? Tell why they didn't have the laundry on the higher floor. The floor would be able to support it. Well, that floor has the fun carpet. <laughs> oh, still one more. Oh, this. Wait, where are we? Whose house are we at? What? Wait a minute. I'm out the wrong way. What is this? Okay. All I mean, right. That might be there, then. You'll probably have to go to get yeah, a plane. Oh! Oh, it's what it's I have. Yeah. Oh, that's the one I had in Houston. A dollar to dry. No, a dollar to wash. And a dollar to dry. Top loader though. Yep. Please inspect washers and dryers. Oh, it's on! Let's have a look. Ah, uh, princess. Yeah. Look how dirty the washing machine is. You should do it. <laughs> 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 I really like these lights, though. 
I would not wash it. I would not wash it. What's the point of this? What is this quarter? Gordon Ramsay used to come on picking for hours. Yeah, I don't know which way. Stairs more. Oh, this is the lobby over here. Yeah, that's where we. Yeah, what? Where are you going, man? Upstairs. Oh, we're just going to the floor. Yeah. What's that one? Oh, that's what that little one is. Oh, what? What is this? I don't know what's scary. Are these stairs or the elevator? I'm expecting bad to happen. I would mean, look. Out there. Breathtaking view of the beautiful city. Hey, I see a train. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a good commodity. Oh, there's a Papa John's. KFC as well. This is for me to follow though. Yeah, I know. God, this, this is a pretty place. I'm glad I don't live here. So glad. Mm, me too. I mean, just think of it. We're just spending two days here. Some people live here. I wonder where Florence's house is now. How far it is? Yeah. 3767. Buena Vista Avenue. Buena Vista Road. Buena Vista. I will say that this is a nice breeze <laughs> coming through here. It's only a good thing I've had. Yeah. Does this place have a pool? I didn't even look. Warner had a pool. I know that one we were looking at at first did. I don't know about this one. Best paddling pool. If this does, then I'm, <laughs> it's paddling pool. I'm not going to get my hopes up about how it looks. I think in California though. Oh well. yeah. Oh, so this is what that nasty thing is. Yeah, that's what, that's what was supposed to be there. The, the mesh was missing. Um, yeah, about that. Look. Yeah, that was almost done too. <laughs> it's totaled. That's it, it's totaled. <laughs> this is, is severely depressing. What a sad place. In the castle. You know what though, I've seen sadder places in this. Yeah. In Dallas. Back streets of London. So, no, East London, East London would like this. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is the alley back here. I'm just like scared of I'm scared of everything here. <coughs> I'm, I'm, I'm boring when I'm gonna die in this room. Here, look. Look how unsafe. Look. I'm just going right over that. <laughs> what the hell is that? What's that? I don't know what that is. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Where are we here? That smell in here though when you walk in. <laughs> God, if you ever need to get out, if there's ever a fire and you need to get out of this. God, you better have a Superman in there. Oh, there's a birdie there. Little birdie. Uh, it's nice and cool out there now. Well guys, it's morning of Saturday, 2nd of June. I didn't get to close off the video last night. I'm so damn tired. That's what I'm going to say. Anthony's on FaceTime right now. 
Thank you very much for watching this, guys, and there's going to be a lot more today when we meet Mary Wilson. Keep it supreme and go with the flow.